I do not have one single handbag in my house. I was gonna go to the hospital, I had an appointment and I had nowhere to put my card and my cards and my phone. So then I was thinking I really need to start investing in good quality handbags. So slowly, slowly, slowly I've been starting to build up a luxury designer handbag collection. Uh, and I I'm kind of gravitating towards colorful bags, not the mainstream bags maybe um, and I like to do research and I found while doing research that the handbags that I've been interested in I haven't necessarily found a lot of information about them there hasn't been a lot of videos uh, about them uh, and if I have found a video it hasn't been in the colors that I enjoy I, I love color and I love I love vintage finds I love these you know handbags that are a little bit different so I was thinking now I'll, the videos that I missed, I'm going to start creating them myself. So I've been thinking about a handbag for about, yeah, for months, for about six months. Uh, that's usually how I like to shop. I don't just buy something. It's very rare that I buy something on impulse. I like to think things through and I've been thinking about this bag for five, six months. Uh, I knew I wanted a blue handbag. I actually ordered another blue handbag from Louis Vuitton uh, about a month ago. It arrived with a broken strap and I had to return it. And I'm very happy I did because I have found this amazing Bulgari Serpenti handbag online. The blue one, a blue color that I really, really, really enjoy. Uh, I'm just so nervous and excited to open it because it was such a disappointment when I opened my last handbag that I bought online. So yeah, my stomach is really turning and um, I'm gonna unbox it now actually. I haven't seen it and I am nervous. I really, really, really am nervous. So I bought this online from a consignment store in Hong Kong called Brand Off, which is pretty well known. Um, they have a 30 day return kind of policy, which is good. So if I don't like it, I can send it back. It was in a good condition, but when I read the reviews, I kind of saw that all of their handbags was in a good condition. But when I read the reviews, people said it feels very new. The photos were pretty bad. Like they were taken in a really, with a really weird white balance in a very bad light. But I've, I've seen this bag, it's not, you know, you can't go to the Bulgari store and buy it anymore, um, not in, in this color. Um, so I was thinking, I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna do it now. I'm just gonna buy it. And yeah, it arrived this morning. And I am nervous, that's ridiculous. I mean, it's, it's just a bag, but I really am nervous. Oh, I hope it is everything that I want it to be. I'm not sure if it comes in a dust bag. Whew. Very well packed. So, oh, it is come. It does come in a dust bag. There, my phone phone fell down. Let's try it again. Alrighty. The bag. Whew. Okay. I am nervous. The Bulgari dust bag. <sighs> oh my gosh. Mm. Oh my gosh, it is much darker than I thought. <gasps> this is dark blue. Oh my gosh, it is gorgeous. <gasps> Look at that bag. Wow. Oh my gosh, that is absolutely gorgeous. What did it put here? Plastic around it. It is so much darker than I thought, but I really like it. I thought it was going to be like almost like a very clear, pretty bright blue color. And this is more of a teal kind of blue. Oh my gosh, it is absolutely gorgeous. That is such a beautiful bag. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm definitely keeping this.
I'm just trying to go through and see if there are any scratches. Look at this bag. It looks brand new, actually. It's like in such a good condition. You get the Bulgari logo in the back. The chain is supposed to be like champagne gold, and I kind of feel like it is. It looked silver at first glance, but it actually is champagne gold little marks from my fingers i need to wash my hands oh that is a gorgeous gorgeous bag and the size is perfect i love the size i have i wear the the wrong um, the wrong color actually with this it is a big size this is like the small size i think it was yeah i can't remember the measurement i'll write it down below but it is just it's gorgeous <laughs> can you see my favorite color is blue Wow, I just have to take a moment and look at it. It is so dark blue. It is such a gorgeous blue, actually. It is amazing. That is amazing. That's gonna go with so many things in the water. <gasps> I actually love it. Oh my gosh, I love it. I think I paid for this about 1,600 Australian dollars, um, which is about 1,150 USD, I think. And this retails for a bit over 3,000 Australian dollars, so almost half price. It is gorgeous. It is such a nice bag. <gasps> I'm so happy I decided to go for this. There is a tiny little bit of creaking here. And I've heard that this flap, that's just what's gonna happen. It's inevitable. Oh, and inside is one compartment. Little cards, 